Here with head coach Daniel LaForce after another close game against Towson, 67-62. Coach, you guys really struggled in the first half, overcame a 24-point deficit to make a close game. What are your general thoughts? The first half just really wasn't us. I mean, we turned the ball over 13 times. We didn't shoot the ball well at all. Defensively, we couldn't keep the ball in front of us and get stops in transition. I mean, it was a tale of two halves. If we had played half as well as we did in the second half, it would be a totally different ball game. What did you tell your team at halftime to kind of light that fire underneath them? Just that it wasn't us. You know, it wasn't anything that we worked on. We were very undisciplined. We turned the ball over. And they knew it. You know, they took accountability for it and came out and performed in the second half. So it's really easy when you know that that's not your team and that's not, you work, not what you worked on, not what you practiced, for them to really realize it and come out in the second half and perform better. So... Um, Towson head coach, one of your former teammates, what kind of emotions are flowing through a game like this? You've had two really close games with yeah. Towson this year, so that plays a huge factor as yep. well. Yeah, no, I mean, you know, Nick and I have been teammates and best friends for a while. Um, we spend a lot of time on the phone talking about our teams and giving each other advice. Um, but game day, it's all about the players, her players versus my players. Coaching has little to do with it, as you saw tonight. Because if I was, you know, really, it was my way, they wouldn't turn the ball over 18 times. So it's just about the players stepping up and being ready to play. Towson and Northeastern has always had a, a rich history in terms of rivalry, and I think it showed that tonight. You're heading down south for two road games, um, facing James Madison for the first time this season, Charleston for the second time. How are you going to prepare your team for those games? Uh, we just got to keep building. Um, we're young. Kids are getting better. Sam is playing very well for us. Sade came off the bench and gave us some great minutes. Cassidy's shooting the ball better. We got Elise back. You know, Jules just has to get more touches. Every day we just got to get better. Every practice we got to get better, and uh, hopefully it'll pay off at the end. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.